My name is Dan Dwyas. I'm from Portland, Oregon. My name is uh, Peter Tash, and a little bit about my story. Um, I'm a mechanical engineer. I worked for 10 years for a company called General Dynamics Robotic Systems. Uh, originally, I'm from Connecticut. Uh, after college, I played on the United States field hockey team. My name is Eric Tejeda. I'm from Boston, Massachusetts. My nationality is Dominican. Uh, I've got uh, over 35 years of uh, experience in the IT field, but it's been primarily desktop support. Hello, I'm Tony Marcino, and um, I'm from Southern Maryland, uh, former school teacher. My name is Keith Hill. I am from Torrance, California. I was a network administrator. I'm a senior level help desk, network administration, you know, users, user training, user setups. My name is John Stanford. I'm originally from Texas. I moved out to California with the military in the late 80s. I had uh, lost most of my skills that had expired and I needed to, uh, to do that and I wasn't finding any responses to my, my job request and my resumes. Uh, well, yeah, I had no IT experience so I was excited about getting into the technology because that's always been a passion of mine so I feel like finally I got a chance. My backstory, I did a lot of technical uh, telecommunications type work and I was looking for a career change because I just wasn't making what I thought I should be making. I had a lot of trouble finding another position even though I had all those years of experience and so through internet searching for a mechanical engineering position I saw an advertisement for Landwind Professional I thought hey you know it's technical I'm, I'll make the jump see how it goes and so far I've really enjoyed myself. I came here to uh, improve and learn on my Cisco skills as well as obtain certification so that I could make myself relevant in the job market again. I'm here uh, working on uh, my Cisco skills. Uh, hopefully that I can, uh, hoping to, to plan on retiring and move on to a, another career. We cover everything about networking, about Wine, about Cisco, CCNA, CCMP, you know, everything. It's unbelievable. There is nowhere else that I was able to identify that you could get the amount of training um, and the, the accelerated pace of training that you can get at Landwind Professional. I thought it was pretty extensive. Um, a lot of it really pertained to a lot of real life scenarios when, when dealing with switching with Cisco. Uh, Landwind really gave me the hand on that I needed. Uh, as with anything else, uh, it's complement with my uh, you know, conceptual training and you know, then one had me out on the, the part of the handout. Technical training was very good. Uh, very intense, but very, a lot more out, a lot more real life than what was, you know, in my previous training. The technical training was uh, absolutely top notch. I learned more in two days than I did probably in four months of self-study for CCNA. Uh, one of the highlights of the camp, I think, just uh, becoming familiar with the command line before, because I was I'm completely, completely green to the command line, so learning it the Saturday before and coming in Saturday after and having some kind of understanding of it was pretty exciting for me. The complete hands-on that I've gotten here has been far beyond any university trainings. Um, basically, it's a great experience because I got the opportunity to get hands-on training on the actual device, which will help me out on the future jobs. Uh, what I'm looking for, to accomplish with this camp is to solidify the material that I already had and to reaffirm the things that I suspected from the first camp, and that being that I do have what it takes, and the program is successful, and the promises that were made for me about how the program was going to work have come to fruition. I'm very happy. Career training, unfortunately, was excellent. I learned a lot of things that I didn't know before. And the placement side of it has been very helpful because being that I've been in the phone company for 30 years, I've done my first interviews back in the 80s. So uh, it's been extremely beneficial. So I'm, I'm, first I was 
I'm not sure I can do this. No, maybe I can do this. And after a couple days, oh, I can do this. I, I can do this. The career training is great. You know, um, when I went to university, I had maybe a week of career training before being launched out into society to get a job. And here it's much more specialized. They really train you on the new technologies like Career Builder and the different sites online. With the career workshops, I've been learning how to uh, accurately address flaws in my resume. So there may be a, a position that I'm applying for that requires 10 years experience in a certain routing technology that's only been out for three years. Uh, basically knowing how to answer that question to where it's not damaging to me but also but helps me and lets the employer know that I'm capable of doing the job. I feel like I could go out in maybe two, three weeks and land a position and feel confident in being able to do the job. After attending these uh, sessions, I was able to think back at past interviews that I have done and boy, I was able to pick out some mistakes that I made and uh, hopefully I've learned enough from these sessions not to make those mistakes again. I feel like they, there's a lot of information up front but as you go along, you start absorbing it, absorbing it. You don't even realize how much you're learning. Lots of information that I, that I certainly was not aware of opened my eyes about the, the kinds of career paths that are, are available to me that I was simply not aware of before. Working for, as a contractor for Wells Fargo is what they call a service manager. And what the service managers do is, is they manage change in, in the infrastructure at Wells Fargo. Where I'm at currently, I started a new position two weeks ago. Um, and um, I absolutely love what I'm doing. Um, well, I currently work at a uh, layer one networking equipment manufacturer in the uh, Portland area. Um, well, we'd be working for Windstream. It's a telecommunication company. Um, it's nationally recognized and it's a growing company, so I'm really excited to be part of that kind of culture. I've heard it has a great culture. I recently uh, accepted a, an offer from a consulting company. Uh, right now they're doing a big project um, with like 200 sites all over uh, the United States. Actually this job here is a step above where where, I've, where we thought we would be at this point. Um, I'm gonna be a senior network architecture. I'm a uh, senior network assessment engineer and a uh, uh, design engineer, and I work um, as a uh, project engineer uh, also. The, all three of the positions basically are one position. It has a bunch of fancy titles. Uh, right now, uh, I'm working in a great company working as a customer support engineer. Right now I'm working with uh, a credit union. Uh, my job is more of a strategy planning type. Uh, I'm conducting right now a risk assessment. Currently I work for uh, Sungard Availability Services, which is a large managed internet provider. Um, we have our own core structure and we have locations both uh, within the United States as well as around the world. Yes, my quality of life right now has been changed like a, a, a lot. Compared to what previous job, it, it, it's a different responsibility. Previous job, I'm more of an administrator and handling day-to-day -day activity and configuration. Now it's not day-to-day, -day, but more of a planning and strategy and hopefully improve the network and improve the infrastructure. And, you know, do day-to-day -day administrator. I got retrained, plugged into to, uh, Landwind Professionals program of, of training, and uh, 87 days from the day that I resi resigned my old position to the time I started the new position uh, it was 87 days. Oh man, I feel great about the quality of life that I'm you know, currently in the situation that I have now. Landwind Professional helped me beyond just the technical abilities, um, but then they also provided some some uh, some career type of training that I think helped a lot as well. Got me back onto to revisiting my interview skills, helped me rewrite a resume that was targeting the appropriate audience. 
it's given me the skills I need to go out and do the job, knowing what I got from the skills and the knowledge I got from Landwin. I sent a lot of thank yous out um, through LinkedIn, through all the folks that were involved in the camps. I want to thank all Landwin professionals for helping me, uh, for, for helping me to be where I am right now. A general thank you to the Land Wan folks. Uh, having plugged into the Land Wan program and their model and getting their training, uh, working with their staff of, of placement professionals, career counselors, um, I've been able to achieve that success that I never was able to achieve before.